हेलो एवरीवन अस्सलाम वालेकुम होप यू गाइस आर कीपिंग वेल मे अल्लाह ब्लेस यू हैव अ गुड गुड टाइम एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब इट्स अ वेरी वेरी हॉट सनी डे एक्चुअली ऑलमोस्ट टू डेज नो रेन and when it's no rain in malaysia it's the weather becomes too hot so it's very compulsory to have rain every day as you can see it's almost going to 7 o'clock but the sun is uh, shining bright so today i am making kebab मटन का मीन्स मटन और यू कैन हैव इफ यू वन अ फैन ऑफ बीफ यू कैन टेक द बीफ मट मीन्स बीफ एज वेल सो हियर इज द क्यूमिन सीट वी आर गोइंग टू टोस्ट इट इन एंड आई एम गोइंग टू पुट सम रेड चिलीज एज वेल जस्ट टोस्ट दैम once it get toasted we have to grind it but not in a powder form it's just like a crushed so you can see it's already toasted now we are cool it down and then grind it that's my mince mutton it's almost uh, about uh, 700 grams and this one i have already crushed uh, red chilies and uh, cumin seed as you can see it's crushed it's not a powder form i have three tomatoes as you can see the sizes of the tomatoes so we have to chop them and put inside the kebab making is very easy and it's very delicious actually when we make kebab right so for that it's not compulsory to put so many spices because when we put so many spices the taste of meat is uh, gone which is uh, for me i don't feel it's so pleasant it's just we should taste the meat as well not just the spices so spices i choose very less because meat have its own flavor also that should uh, not die it should exist in our recipes and in our dishes so we can differentiate so i'm chopping tomatoes very thin yeah tomorrow is eid and because uh, our qurbani all we do in pakistan so here is just uh, we are our preparations are uh, going to be done so and some of we have lockdown here and not many guests cannot come so even guest at all cannot come it's not about many nobody can uh, visit there so we are preparing for ourselves only so this one for i am going to make for tomorrow so we can uh, you know have a relaxed time after this going to iron kids clothes my husband's my own so get ready because the feel of eid is there so we have to you know enjoy it and thank god thanks to allah he has uh, given us this day to celebrate to share and you know be with each other so it's a blessing anyhow we have to follow the sops that is very important it's just for our own safety you know so but don't get depressed just stay happy whatever the moment we get is uh, we have to live that that is very important tomatoes are chopped coriander is chopped onion is chopped i didn't show you all because you might uh, see me about another 15 minute in the video so 
chopping is all just the normal way right so we, our chopping is done so add the tomatoes here is the green chili so here is the salt making this kebab is very easy and it's very delicious you can have it with the chapati with rice because it's a eat day so that's why almost three days i'm um, showing you the recipes for it so maybe you might like it and uh, it it is it might be helpful for you so after all we are friends and it's you guys are my family so it's nice to share and care with each other so i'm using my hand to mix it we are going to mix it well as you can see it's mixed already now i'm adding the two eggs so eggs is just uh, for binding it's uh, helpful it will not uh, your kebab won't break mix it well with uh, all your mixture i have mixed my eggs now i show you the pan so on this flat pan i am going to show you making one kebab see i took this much because uh, after we put it on the pan it will shrink so we do pat it i think i need a little bit more the rest all i am going to freeze for tomorrow so this one i am showing you to So you can uh, easily fry for yourself and you know how now you can see it's this much thick it's not too not too thick it should not be too thick you can see all the green color coriander looks so nice we are going to shift it to the pan there it goes and now we have to cover it just cover it on low flame and let it cook well so when we cover it it will be very moist from inside it won't get dry and it get cooked also very well the taste and flavor is marvelous here i show you our kebab so for kebab you need this type flat spoon again see one side is done we flip to the other side like that see it's really beautiful so just leave it like say eight side about it will take about seven seven minutes then your kebab and you can put on this pan you can uh, put like four uh, according to the capacity of your pan and stove kebab is ready <laughs> it's very delicious and i show you shortly see how beautiful very soft and you can see it's cooked until from inside but it's very soft it's very hot that's why i cannot uh, hold it properly try it enjoy it stay connected see you again bye bye